We were all just performing at UCB Theater, Upright Citizens Brigade, here in New York, and um, Paul and I had known each other for about 10 years and had done um, a lot of improvising and sketch shows together, and then Aziz was doing stand-up, and um, so we were all kind of, he knew who we were and we knew who he was, and it was just sort of this mutual admiration society, and um, Aziz started doing this show every week called Crash Test, and um, it was like a stand-up show, and he kind of wanted people to co-host it with him, so the first week he asked me, and um, and we uh, we did a, a sketch on stage called Shutterbugs, which was about um, we basically had uh, I had all these kids headshots. <laughs> don't don't ask why. And uh, I had all these headshots of little kids, and we did this bit on stage where we were like headshot photographers, and we basically just criticized these headshots of these adorable little kids and just like ripped these kids apart. <laughs> And then that sort of uh, created uh, the sketch that we eventually did called Shutterbugs, where we, we sort of changed it so we became talent agents for little kids. So that's how kind of we met, like just doing bits on stage um, and doing videos. And then he and Paul um, co-hosted uh, in subsequent weeks, and they did a video um, and a bit on stage about um, kind of making fun of, of shitty magicians and stuff. And they did this bit called Illusionators, um, which is vaguely inspired by Chris Angel and uh, and so that's sort of where you know two kind of popular sketches of ours came from just kind of doing bits on stage um, at UCB really when people even talk about like those other groups we're actually super flattered to even be uh, compared to any of them I mean uh, we have a lot of fun doing what we're doing and, and try to do um, really funny stuff, um, but yeah, I mean, there are amazing um, sketch groups uh, in the pantheon of sketch history, and uh, yeah, I mean, that's always like really flattering to be compared to any of those guys. Um, we just want to like, uh, we just want to keep doing our thing, and, and, and we really don't care about anything else but just like making funny stuff, you know, like we don't worry about... Um, what's coming up down the road or anything like that and we try you know the, the the great thing about like the the comedy world right now is that um there's just like a really good I feel like it's a really good time for comedy you know there's just a lot of cool stuff going on and people are doing you know especially in, in New York for sure like um people are just doing like really smart different funny stuff and um you know we're we're, we're glad to be um in the mix and and um, what, what's cool about it is that there's also like this sort of really supportive community and like no one ever um, shits on anybody else you know you don't ever hear people like just attacking other people it's just kind of a cool um, community um, right now and there seems to be like a lot of um, just admiration for, for different people doing different stuff whether it's stand up or sketch or improv or whatever like um, it just seems to be like a really supportive cool thing and I mean for example um, you know, we were able to get um, some guys from SNL to do some bits in our show, like Andy Samberg and Fred Armisen and Bill Hader, and um, you know, they, they we've known those guys for a while, and but they just really liked the show, and we were like, but you guys are already on a really great show. It's a very famous sketch comedy show, you know, and they're just like, yeah, but it'd be fun to do your show, you know. So that's just kind of cool. There's no like, you know, no one's no one fights or whatever. It's just kind of cool to pop up in other people's projects. Oh,